I did IB in St. Mary. And after that, I didn't know what I wanted to do. And I naturally gravitated to a career which I thought would not be too difficult. So I decided to go to law school. I did uh, law for just under a year. It, it didn't quite work out the way I thought it would. And then, when I was just about to leave South Africa to come back, a really good friend of mine called Lama gave me a call and told me to come out to his university just to hang out for a week, weekend. And I ended up liking it so much that I enrolled and they got me in to do the degree that I actually wanted to do, which was marketing and management to the mining economics. And I mean, being in South Africa opened my eyes to everything that I wanted Kenya to be. My first encounter with whiskey is actually very embarrassing. Uh, I, I was working at an ad agency and I got given a bottle of uh, Johnny Walker as a gift. And Johnny Walker has what they call a Midas cap. So it's the anti counterfeit measure that they have at the top so that the liquid stays in gold. That's the name Midas. So I got given this bottle and I didn't know that that was in part of the cap. It was in part of the closure. So when I got that bottle, I, I broke off what was the anti-counterfeit measure on the bottle. I proceeded to enjoy the rest of the whiskey. But yes, I, I, I mean, I, it, it took me a month to finish the whole bottle. But it was only later that I realized, oh, no, that is actually supposed to be Because I thought I hadn't opened the bottle completely. It's actually quite, quite an embarrassing story. When I joined uh, East Africa Birds, which is where I work currently, it's I was a brand manager for Johnny Walker and as with any, anything or anyone who's doing marketing you must know or, or get into your brand, you must know what it is that you work with and the history of Johnny Walker is very very colourful and very very exciting and I got to learn about whiskey at that point and then I managed Bailey's as well, Bailey's is a combination of Irish cream and Irish whiskey something that I learned on the job as well and then I got to be, the role came up to be the ambassador for our whole luxury portfolio and the interest that I picked up in spirits up until that point for me made me a natural fit for it. I got into the role and that's where my learning curve became very very steep but very enjoyable as well because as you can't know about whiskey without tasting. So you do get to go to a lot of exclusive events and tastings and meet people. And when you learn about something, you get to enjoy it a whole lot more. And that's how I became uh, a whiskey ambassador. So it's not just for whiskey, it's for a whole portfolio of spirits. But whiskey is where you find a lot of uh, consumer-facing education. Whiskey is great stuff. And, and you should try it and you should enjoy it, but remember, have some water while you drink, have something to eat during, before you go out and have a lot to drink. You know, drink drinking alone has been seen as antisocial, so none of us will engage in too much antisocial behavior, but pace yourself, don't drink too much, definitely don't drink and drive. Yeah, it should be good.